Hey Eric, Justin here. This is the uh, the computer setup for connecting to the total station for use at that master's meet. I uh, I provided you the total station and uh, battery and charger. I also have to give you the uh, cable which includes a USB adapter right over here and the, the normal serial end that goes into the total station. On the laptop you have a uh, power cord, power adapter with a very tiny power end right over here and I have pr provided a uh, USB mouse which you may or may not want to use it probably makes it a little bit easier this tiny little uh, power adapter goes right in where that red wire uh, is sticking out let's see if I can get that looking right it's get into in that uh, DC in and plug the uh, power adapter into the wall outlet I suggest you put the mouse into the uh, USB port on the uh, on this side of the computer, left hand side of the computer, and use the computer the uh, USB port on the other side of the computer. There are two of them to connect to the total station. So we'll do that right now. Connect the USB port into the total station. Hook up this and uh, then hook. Serial Let's cable. This one directly into the total station. All right. To check the the prism constant, after we level the unit, hit the escape button, hit the mode button, hit the correction button. There we go. That's the 30 millimeter offset. We're all set and ready to go. If you need to change it, just hit the select button and you can hit the clear to clear it and change it just remember to hit the enter button at the end and your values will be stored okay let's pop open the computer computer with a flat screen it's a asus model the power on button is here on this corner uh, if you press it the blue light will go on and the screen will start to display uh, The screen is opened up. It takes a few seconds. We'll just uh, use the mouse, either the mouse pad or use the, um, the other mouse to open up uh, field links. I'm just going to double click here. Field links opens up to version 1.32 B10. I set up field links with three events Let's go and take a look at the options make sure those are set up properly. Preferences, go into laser links. This is a Pentax, so you can leave that in there. Triangular, the communications, this sometimes changes. Okay, no COM port has been assigned. This is actually COM port 3, so we'll give it COM port 3. 9600 baud, no parity, 8 bits, one stop bit, no flow control. You could ignore the network. We'll just say OK here and OK. For each, for each of the events I added two users in there. Let's go and set up information on this one. I set the user to six attempts. Set the circle radius to 1.07 for the hammer. I'm going to set the controls. I already have the total station aimed at a uh, reflector. I'll go ahead and hit the set button. Happy sounds from the Pentex. The circle of radius center is uh, set and the angle is all set and we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and measure. I have the One camera the aimed at uh, reflectors out here. It's measuring. The Pentex is clicking away. And there we are. Uh, the throw is 31.14. If we uh, wanted to do the second throw, rather than going on to the next line, just over, go ahead and overwrite this mark. Say yes. Or erase it. And we got the same mark, of course. And do the control marks. You can actually save them 
since we have enough space for keeping all these if you want to keep your control mark so you can review them afterwards just uh, save each control mark uh, you can store up to six of them over here which should be plenty for the event at the end of all the stuff uh, it's a little better to exit uh, gracefully clicking on the tab here uh, and clicking the exit button that's preferable to clicking this X which may not save your values so go ahead hit the file and exit and then you're done. To quit out of the uh, entire windows just hit the shutdown button and you should be good to go. Good luck at the Masters Meet. I'll be talking to you uh, as you go along. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.